So today, we're going to measure the outer area of this office block using Mosier. So we want the footprint of this building. Now we can use a special path type called wall mode. So we're going to open up our Mosier app. We're going to tap on the green plus icon. And then we're going to select closed shape. Now a closed shape measurement means that we'll be measuring the area and the perimeter of the outer footprint of this office block. So it's now waiting to connect. We can see that it's turned red by rotating. Once it's turned red, it tells us to place at the start. So with closed shape measurements, you need to remember your start position because we're going to finish in exactly the same place. We're going to choose here, making it memorable. We're going to hold the device with two fingers and a thumb, which is quite a light grip on there. So as we place our device, it captures the first point. You heard it go from red to green. That means it's captured the point. We chose wall mode before we placed it down. We'll continue in wall mode path type, and that's the path we're gonna use all the way around this building. Now, as we walk along, we can now simply go around the corner and capture the point on this plane of this wall. Now, by doing that, it will automatically extrapolate to the corner. We can continue moving along place it in an area where you're not on any bumps or cracks or grooves, anywhere where you might get an uneven placement. Mosier needs to be completely still in order to capture a measurement. So our aim is to place it somewhere where we can make the device completely still. We're going to move along on this plane. We're now going to capture this window. And to do that, we just simply capture this plane and then we place it directly onto the glass. We then move back to the edge and we continue to measure on each surface of the office block as we tend to work our way around. Now, sometimes on a longer run, you need to stop within the green zone, as, as we say, no later than the amber zone. So we're on this plane of this wall, but you can continue to pause on that same plane on a long stretch. Now here is a good example of an obstacle which is in the way. So let's say that we didn't want to capture this as part of our office block. It's no problem with Mosier because what we can do is simply walk around this. Now, I can't get to the other side of this obstacle within the green zone and certainly no later than the amber zone. So what I can do is walk along and when you put your Mosier device on the ground, It sounds like it's capturing the data. It's actually in ignore mode. So the line that it's put on my drawing, as you can see, is now an ignore line. So let's walk along. We'll place it again. So it's still ignoring these measurement points. We can now go back to the plane of this wall. And as soon as we place it, it starts drawing the measurement from where we last stopped on the wall down to here, which is showing me 44 foot. So let's continue. And obstacles like these pipes that are in the way, it doesn't matter because we can choose which plane of the uh, wall that we want to choose and the area. So we're now almost back where we started. I can see where we started the measurement. So now we need to finish the measurement in the same place, right in there.
we tap on the red stop icon and we can see now that our measurement has given us a perimeter of 512.4 foot and the total area is 8,591.1 square foot. And that is how you can measure the outer perimeter and blueprint of this office block using Mosier.